Hello, operator. How can I help you? Hi, I'm uh, I'm looking for a Tom. Ah, yes. Give me just one moment. Great. There's some quietness and then a click. This is Tom's Pizzeria. What kind of pie can I make for you tonight? I need information from Shimatsu on how they refine Valonia into hard light. All right. So we're looking at a pepperoni pie with uh, blue olives. Yes. Are you uh, looking for any sort of um, particular ways that you'd like to go about picking this up? No. I don't need to know the details. Would you like us to run it to you? <laughs> yes. That'd be wonderful. All right. Delivery is just a small extra charge. How much are you looking to pay for this pie? As much as it costs. Whatever, you name the price. Good choice, sir. Of course. We should have that to you in uh, three or four business days. Wonderful. Does that sound right to you? Absolutely. Great. We'll see you then. And we hope you continue to call Booker's Pizza. Looking forward to it, Tom. Thank you. Hmm. Oh, finally. Thank God. Welcome. Have a seat. Oh, you, you too worship the battle gods of Valkyrie. Commendable. That's commendable. Okay. Whatever. Um, all right. So, uh... I took a look at your, your records and brought you here specifically um, because you were the best of the best threat analysts that I could possibly find, and I wanted to make sure that we weren't going to have any more uh, rough patches here at Valkyrie. So, Nyx, hmm. these are uh, the other, uh, well, we're missing one, but here's two out of the three of the other Valkyrie Upper City executives. I see we're a standing kind of meeting very well. Yeah. Not much, not much. Artyom, if I remember correctly. <laughs> Artyom, yes? Yeah, Was that the name? Arty if it's easier. And then V, I believe it was. Very well. And then that must make you Commander Gray. That's, yep, that's me. Hmm. Well, let's get down to business, shall we? So, today is the day we finally re reopen our mining operations in the wasteland. Now, V and Nix, I know you're not familiar with, probably not familiar with what's going on here. I just debriefed Artie here, but um, the gist of it is that before Salvation City was even, even a thing, not too long ago, um, Valkyrie came here and we found a shitload of Valonium. Now, if you remember, Valonium is the material that's used to refine and make hard light. Now, these mining operations, we got them started up. However, it wasn't too long before. I don't know what happened, but something happened, and the uh, mining operation was pretty much... Um, uh, it was a bust. They had, we had to pull everybody out. There was a lot of people that died, and uh, the actual location of the mine was lost. It was We couldn't even find it in our records. So, fast forward to about a year ago, we found out that the path down to the old mining facilities were reopened. So, I sent man after man down there to figure out if we can get these things restarted, because... If you all are familiar, Shimetsu, they are, they have the monopoly on hard light. And they've had it for far too fucking long. So, what mm. we're going to do today is finally restart the mining operations. Now, what I want the three of you to do is to go down there, down to the volcano. You're going to drop ship in, and I want you to get your hands on the first sample of Valonium from there. 
okay? And bring it up to me. I want to have it in my hands. I want to make sure that this operation is complete and done, okay? But I want to make sure that you guys all need to be suited up. You got to have decent weapons and armor because <laughs> the wasteland is no fucking joke. I am a bit uh, underdressed, admittedly. My luggage was confiscated <laughs> uh, through customs, but I shall suffice with a single weapon or something of the sorts when I get it back from Artyom. Yeah, of course. Just a security precaution. I'm sure we can get I have my own it up. armor, if you will. That's fine. Good. All right. So, um, when you're all ready and geared up, just uh, let me know, and then we can we can get the show on the road. This needs to be a relatively quick mission, as I um, as I need Artie here back. That should be easy enough. Okay. Well, go suit up, and um, we will um, we'll get this show on the road. Let me know when you're all suited up and ready to go. Where? Sounds good. Where should we meet? Just out in the front there. Um, the, uh, absolutely. I won't be joining you on this on this mission. Let me make that clear. I'm not I'm not going to put myself in the in the line of fire here. Yeah. Um, you wouldn't need wouldn't to dirty your shoes. I'm just commander. curious where to meet the yeah. pilot for this. Oh, well, that was fast. Uh, are these are these the crates? Yeah, these are the crates. Undamaged. Should be good to go. Amazing. Okay. Yeah. Something else took all the damage. <laughs> what, did you scratch the ship You'll or something? Okay. No. Scratched myself. I thought you were the threat Long analyst. Time, sir. Mm -hmm. I'm the threat. Okay. <laughs> <sighs> Jesus Christ. All right. Hopefully we're still going to make our appointments. Holy shit. Um, yeah, already. Um, Do you need help with that, sir? I don't know if you'll... It's quite heavy. Wouldn't um, you to, uh, it's all right. I think I, a nail or it's on the edge okay. of the table. Thank you. I think I can handle it. It's all right. Um, Artie, if you want to, um, I don't know if there's any more representatives of, uh, from Mistaru, but if not, then uh, maybe Traverse can get you some uh, some transportation down to the Undercity. Um, worst case, just head down. Do you know how Fair to get enough. to the Undercity from the row? So I don't. Uh, I haven't been myself, but uh, I'm sure I could find a local to take me. Okay. Oh, you know Land uh, uh, no. V? Sorry. Um, okay, awesome. Great. Well, you know what? Actually... Well landed. Yeah. On the table. <laughs> um, we, we just allow that, right? Yes. I don't know our customs yet. Okay. All right, well, <laughs> <clears throat> V, if you want to accompany Artie here and head down to the Undercity, then that'd be great. And represent Valkyrie among the other corporations. Before we go, I do have some questions. Uh, are we interested in, in any specific properties, or are we just trying to get a lay of the land? A little bit of both. Yeah. Um, see what you can see All and right. uh, relay any information to myself. If you think you can find any any businesses worth um, investing in. All right. Sounds good. All right. Well, off you go. We're um, okay. on the clock here. Yeah, so I'm going to get out of this equipment here before we go down, and hopefully you feel better. I'm sure you can, you've can. you probably had worse. Yeah. I'll get patched up. Yeah. All right. Okay. Good luck. Thank you very much. All right. Good. Yeah, bye, V. Yeah, you'll be fine. Okay. So. You need any uh, help with those? Um, yeah, you know what, you mind, uh, grabbing one of these and bringing them over to the lab? I want to run, uh, run a, one of my own scans on them. Just do not, do not drop it. Whatever you do, because these things are... Are they explosive by Highly, highly explosive. These, this is, like, you know, I've, you know what a power crystal is? I, I did, we saw plenty down there. Okay, so the power crystals oh. that are that are down there probably are impure power crystals. These are pure power crystals. Like, they are. <clears throat> you can't fuck around with these. It's like the, the the top of the top here. So let's get it over to my lab. Well, I'm glad I was the one that took the hits. Then you took the hits. Yeah. 
And why the hell did you do that? Uh, well, it wasn't, uh, with my consent, sir. It was more of a large creature decided to have a, uh, direct conversation with me. Oh, that sounds painful. Yeah. Just another scar added. Well, I'm you glad you make scars it... yourself, sir. Uh, yeah. I I assume you know about all. I assume you're familiar with um, the events on Hellion last year. I did read the report. It seemed like uh. Quite the event occurred. Yeah. <sighs> Lost a lot of fine men and women that day. Yeah. Can't yeah, weak, actually. Of war. Yeah. All right. From the looks of it, this is. Yeah. Pure Valonium. This is incredible. Did you see the caves down there? We didn't explore into the interior of the volcano, but there was plenty more boxes where this came from. That's great. That's very, very great to hear. This is this is our key to getting rid of the of Shimetsu's monopoly on hard light. Been pretty quiet up here today. Yeah, not much going on. Why do you have people coming and going really? Is that you have an assault rifle and a pistol? Who gave you an assault yeah, rifle? The guy, the guy that you were working with that went down to the uh, I think the undercity or something. He told me to hold on to it till he gets back. God damn it! Fine. Do not po keep pointing that at the ground, okay? Do not point okay. that anywhere near me. Okay. 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 God, I'm incompetent. Oh, Rhapsidia. What do I owe the honor? It's wonderful to see you here. Uh, I'm sorry, but your voice sounds familiar, but uh, I don't think I remember you. No? Um, I thought we had... It has been some time, time last at the very year. least. Okay. Well, maybe I'm just getting mix that mixing up with someone bad. else. My bad. I mean, you are correct, I, and your voice does sound familiar, but... Okay. Uh, well, what... Sorry, at the very least, um... Well, uh, uh great we to see you. Looking... Yes, great to see you as well. Uh, we were looking to possibly make a deal with, uh, for possible weapons for the Union. That's great to hear. Um, here, you know what? Let's step into my office. Okay. Uh, so, just a, um, uh, General contract of outfitting your soldiers with Valkyrie weapons? More or less, yes. I do know that we might have individual requests here and there. I, I do believe that we can think of at least two off the top of our heads. Okay. Yep. Um, but, how many? Uh, in general, yes. Got it. Um, how many? How many soldiers do you need outfitted with with uh, with weapons? And what kind of weapons do you need? There isn't much of an armada, I don't believe, but. Uh, at the very least, for more security for our our members, if they if they request it, at the very least. All right. Mm -hmm. Well, that sounds great. Yeah. I'll um I'll actually I'm gonna defer you to our threat analyst. He's um he's a little he's a little green, but this is uh you know it's, it's not his first rodeo. He's he knows what he's doing. But I'll I'll leave him to you guys to draft up a contract. But um, I'm more than happy to do something like that. Let me, uh, let me see if I can call him over here for you. So, let's get this hammered down, shall we? Hmm. Okay, then. All right. So, uh, you would like your, um, GU Upper City Executives to be outfitted with Valkyrie weaponry. Um, are we talking, well, uh... Everyone gets a class one. As a part of the contract, we could approach, we, we would be able to get higher classes at a discounted price since we are also as a part of the contract if we so re requested would that be reasonable at a discounted price um yeah that that's that seems pretty fair um i'll have to send it over to our legal team and see if they sign off on that we have a whole system of checks and balances to make sure that that's 
Um, that's reasonable, but um, I can uh, I can I can give you a little bit of a discount. I'm not sure what the percentage would be yet, but we can figure. At, figure... at the very least, I would. At the very least, I would hope that the the, the class one across the board would be its would be justification for at least that much for yeah yeah it makes sense i understand enterprise for that so i'll send over the the draft of the agreement to our legal team and um we'll have a final version of the contract and uh what's your what's your radio channel where can i contact you uh the uh channel 40 channel 40 okay i'll um i'll let you know on channel 40 when our agreement is ready and our legal team has uh drafted it all up I was off by one yeah. channel. <laughs> All right. Hey, this is Artyom. Luca, do you happen to be up in the tower right Thank now? Thank you. All right. I need to know your name, by the way. Uh, Luca. Yeah. Luca. It's good to meet you. Sinon Hanipi. Pleasure. Nice to meet you as well. Yeah, I'm in, I'm in the tower. Apologies. Lots of voices. All right. Um, I trust you'll see yourselves out. I'll, uh, the, the guard at the of front course. should... Uh, should let you out, and, and uh, uh, since we never, since we never actually got to talk to you about this, uh, if you haven't heard by now, I am the actual uh, the union governor for the Outer Ring. So if congratulations, if you need to deal with the <laughs> thank you, uh, if you do need to deal with uh, the union, uh, my myself or Sinon would be the ones to, to uh, contact. Okay, great. Thank you so much. Yes, you're welcome. Have a good day. You as well. Take care. Hey, Artie. Hi there. Oh, what a time down in the other city. That place reeks. Oh, God, I bet. It's pretty much just like a big sewer, right? I haven't seen. I haven't even seen it for myself. Yeah, effectively. But uh, <laughs> that's the part I was used to. It's all the strange smells and food and stuff that they have down there. It was pretty harsh on the nose. Yeah, I bet. Either way. How to how to go? Important stuff. Uh, yeah, it, it went pretty well. I did catch the tail end of the tour, um, so I didn't see all of the districts, but I did go around with some of the locals to uh, get the lay of the land. Good. How um any, a, anything uh, interesting? Yeah, yeah, there's some stuff that we could definitely deal with down there. There's a uh, blacksmith and a gunsmith down there who are very short supplied, and uh, they happen okay. to be trying to look for a contract with Masaru to provide security or provide arms for security down in the Undercity, so. Well, that seems like they easy seem picking right interested there. In, um, Traverse was also down there and they're looking to provide security alongside Masaru. I don't know if there's some sort of competition between them for the spot, but uh, they're okay. looking for armaments as well. So I think we can beat Shometsu to it. Great. Did Shimetsu not seem interested in the Undercity at all? Oh, they were definitely interested. They sent uh, probably four or five of their guards along with uh, the party, so they had uh, that contract for security lined up with Masaru. There's something that irks me about arming the GU. I don't know. It's, it's, it's just it's weird to be giving the GU... The same organization that we waged war over, like, 16, 17 years ago, mm -hmm. um, arming them with, uh, with weapons, especially their executives. Now, they don't seem to have um, any sort of malicious intent, from what I can tell, but mm -hmm. the problem is that it's... If the other corporations see that we are arming the GU with weaponry, then I'm hoping... Well, they might see it as not, uh, not not treason, but what's the word? Um, they might think that we are working with the GU for a potential um, uh, for a potential uprising, I guess. Welcome back, Nix. You'll be seeing a, uh, a contract from the Galactic Head of Trident uh, on your desk shortly. That's great to hear. Okay. How'd the deal with uh, with Trident go? In our favor, I hope. Wonderfully. I think this would be the most mutually uh, beneficial deal. On top of uh, so, 
let me start this off by saying the odds were not in our favor to begin with, as they have already signed a contract with Sumetsu. But the contract in it is that they get paid more based off of whether they sell more Sumetsu versus Valkyrie. The benefit to our deal is we've been confirmed with at least a 60% deployment on Valkyrie weapons, which would put us in the lead there with Triton. On top of that, the deal also includes a clause on the new R&D weapons that we have in development. I juiced it up by giving them a little wink-wink, nudge-nudge on our future plans. Great. Kept it relatively vague, but you know how gossipers are. Once when they get a hint of something new, they go crazy. Absolutely. Yeah. Not only that... They also have an issue that they need help with, and the reason that they wanted to reach out to Valkyrie over Shimetsu is our capability in being able to handle such issues. <laughs> there seems to be some sort of large-based criminal, something about a commander of a large ship or something like that, running some sort of organization. I'm sure it's very horrible but we'll have to root them out. So the deal includes a portion of my time and skills in order to help hunt down and track this criminal. Rooting out this criminal, I believe, would be beneficial for all of us. Not only would we be able to take the credit for being able to exterminate him or interrogate or whatever necessary. I don't know the full details of this organization, if you will. Uh, but on top of that... We also remove a threat here on Hellion, as I'm sure they want to sabotage operations. Uh, a deal that hasn't been done yet, but has been uh, talked about, so something to, to do in the future, is also uh, giving rights to Triton in order to promote and advertise and be able to generate revenue that way based off of our new products. Interesting. So, like okay. a, a media spin, if you will. Right using them to their abilities. That makes sense. There you have it. Okay, that seems great. Did you um did you happen to slip anything in in our favor? I raised the bar a little bit, but wasn't able to add any extra clauses. The <laughs> I believe his name was was Reginald, uh, the galactic head of Trident is very skilled and uh deal making right he's definitely he knows he knows what the fuck he's doing and plus messing with trident is always playing with fire since they kind of control our everybody's public image uh, a few choice words behind closed doors can help massage any concerns let them know that we've provided fail safes in the weapons some way to shut them down should they get testy things like that should help calm the corpse nice yeah that's a good idea um aside from that do you think there's anything that's uh that the gu owns that we could um kind of manipulate maybe um i'm just thinking of things to sneak into this contract basically the gu is the public face for the rest of the planet now on one hand they're not worth much down there but they are many so having some sort of connection or good face to be able to push anything that we need down there would be beneficial some sort of uh middleman less hated face if you will right either of those options would be good or both both would be better i'm sorry excuse me i gotta i gotta head to mm. i, I got i got someone calling me right now i need to head away um feel free to yes, add go to the bathroom he's doing the potty dance god damn it uh, add whatever else you need to <laughs> into commander. into the data pad uh, for the GU contract. Is this the deal? Yes, it is. Um, and I'll see all of you Would tomorrow. Would you like me to 